Why was Emily Ratajkowski asked to re-examine her dating life by Olivia Wilde? According to a source, Olivia Wilde wants Emily Ratajkowski to re-examine her dating life and the men she chooses to go out with after the couple engaged in much more than just late-night chit-chat in Japan. Emily acknowledges that she feels horrible about Olivia. Harry Styles and Emily Ratajkowski were photographed sharing a passionate kiss at a party in Tokyo months after he split from Olivia Wilde. Shortly after, rumors of a dispute between friends Olivia and Emily circulated. Emily participated in a Vogue Spain interview where she said that she feels bad for her buddy Olivia. Emily also expressed astonishment when the images of her and Harry sharing a kiss went viral. She also discussed how odd she thinks it because people are curious about her personal life. Having particular experiences, then having the entire world know about them and comment on them, is quite strange. I'm just an individual that transitioned from a three to a four-year relationship. Olivia responds to Emily's assertion. Emily shouldn't feel horrible for Olivia, a source told Daily Mail. When asked what Olivia thought of Emily's statement, she needs to reevaluate how she dates and who she chooses to go out with. Really, Emily should just concentrate on being a mother. Olivia only requests that Emily refrain from mentioning her by name. They continued. Emily claimed during her interview that the rumors about her and Olivia getting into a fight were untrue. However, the source also stated that Olivia believed Emily breached the girl code and her friend betrayed her. Emily's allegation about not fighting with Olivia when she was seen making out with Harry last month in Japan is true, the person claimed. Since Olivia hasn't spoken to Emily since then, there hasn't been any conflict between them. She violated the girl code and betrayed her. Emily discusses Adam Levine. Emily also talked about the popular TikTok she made to support Summer Stroh after she accused Maroon 5 singer Adam Levine of having an extramarital affair with her. She stated her motivation for creating the film as follows, All my social network algorithms showed content focused on slut-shaming a 23-year-old girl. Instead of asking what happens to the person who is in a relationship and as a result has contracted commitments, the woman said, I was irritated with the way in which an attack narrative was being built on this girl.